Hi, and welcome along to Arsenal Fan TV. Time to preview the semi-final of the Carabao Cup taking place at the Emirates Stadium on Wednesday. Arsenal taking on Chelsea in the second leg. Now, um, this is a very important game for Arsenal. Um, one of our few chances, well, one of only two chances to win a trophy this season um, is Carabao Cup or Europa League. That's it. We're not going to win nothing else. Um, so... We're in the semi-final and this is a fantastic chance to win it. And we went away to Stamford Bridge. We got a nil-nil draw with a really depleted team on that day. Let's have it right. And um, for me on that night, it was a good result. It would have been better if we'd have gotten a away goal because that will count if we go into extra time. But to go there, it was a full strength Chelsea team and to not concede the way we've been conceding recently was a really, really good result. And we've played Chelsea so many times recently. It's our third meeting against Chelsea this month. We've played them twice in the league. Both of those have been draws. You know, who knows how this game's going to turn out. Um, it's just been a stalemate when we've played for most of this season. But in cup competitions, we've also got a good record against them. Remember, we beat them in the FA Cup final last year. We beat them in the Community Shield. So there's nothing to fear from Arsenal. And we should have players back. Players that we didn't have um, in that first leg, like Mesut Ozil, will be back in the team. Of course, there's no Alexis Sanchez no more because he's gone. But I kind of look on that and think to myself, it's a positive thing. Because even in the semi-final, he was on the bench. Is he going to come on? Why hasn't he started? It's all done and dusted now. We know the situation with Alexis Sanchez. He's gone. We've got Henrik Mkhitaryan we've got to move on. And there's been no greater way to move on than to win this game and to get into the final of the Carabao Cup. A competition, by the way, or League Cup, should I call it, that Arsene Wenger has never won. So it would be great to win this competition. Now, on the injury side, um, Monreal, who came back at the weekend and looked really fantastic in that um, victory over Crystal Palace, um, he's, he's still struggling with the injury. He's still a doubt whether he'll play or not. Uh, Arsene Wenger said in his press conference that Giroud and Welbeck are still a bit short. So if they do figure, it will probably be off of the bench. So don't expect to see those two. Aaron Ramsey, though, is back in the squad, which is a positive, as I said. And, you know, we should be able to go into this team. Uh, sorry, go into this game with more or less, apart from those guys, quite a strong team, particularly at back with Koscielny being back in there um, and Mustafi. Remember for the first leg, we was having to pay Holding, we was having to pay Chambers. So, um, should be a strong Arsenal team and it needs to be a strong Arsenal team and there's no reason to put out weakened team or to play youngsters or anything like that. And I know Arsene Wenger, he likes to show you faith in the youngsters that have got him to that far, but this is one of our few chances to win a trophy, so go full strength. There's no game at the weekend, remember, because uh, we're out of the FA Cup, so there's no excuse not to go all out, full strength, full pelt at trying to win this. And listen, Chelsea will. Chelsea will not play a weakened team. Chelsea will come with a strong team. And Chelsea, listen, they're going to be in good spirits. They had a fantastic win at the weekend, beating Brighton by four goals to nil. We also had a fantastic win, but winning by four goals to one. That 4-0, actually, even though Chelsea played really well in that game, got off to a great start, kind of flattered them a bit because Brighton did have chances, could have had a penalty. You know, so we've really got to be on the front foot against Chelsea in this game. Really put them under a lot of pressure. And, you know, who knows? Um, it should be a great atmosphere. Chelsea are going to bring a lot of fans to the game because they get a bigger allocation. So they'll be supported and cheered on by their fans. But I think this is a chance for us. We're at home. This is a chance for us to get to the final. Remember, this season at home, we've only been beaten once and that was by Manchester United. So this really is a good chance to get to the final. And listen, if we could get to the final, it would be a real, real great lift around the place. Um... One thing, Henrik Mkhitaryan cannot play um, tomorrow. He's a uh, cup tied, so don't look for Mkhitaryan to be playing in this game. Um, but listen, hopefully we can get out there and get the job done. It will be massive if we do it. And even though it's the Carabao Cup, and I know sometimes we've looked down on it, Tim Pot Cup or whatever, but right now, for us, it will be a great competition to win. 
Um, what do you guys think the team should be? Uh, well, one thing I've got to say, Kalasinac has to start in that game. Now, whether Monreal starts or not, Kalasinac has to start. I know Maitland-Nars has been doing well, but for me, go with your strongest possible team. And if we do that, we've got a great chance of winning it. Um, so, listen, let's keep our fingers crossed. Let's hope it goes well. We're looking forward to the semi-final of the Carabao Cup.